fucking come on. Come fuck with me. I'll get your ass, you jerk. Don't fuck with me, fellas. This ain't my first.
day. This, this is what it's all about. They said that we were too loud, too proud. They told us that we couldn't do things on our own terms. And we said, we weren't asking for your permission. <laughs> Be careful, Sally. You'll give her a bigger head than she already has. So, flaming table again? Time tested, crowd approved. Also an insurance risk. <laughs> to mention we've seen it before. But that was one hell of a main event. Way to rally the crowd afterwards, too. Well, I meant what I said. I told you when we founded this place that we could pull it off. Couldn't do any of it without you. Oh, I know. I'm very aware of how much time I spend doing paperwork to keep the lights on around here so that you can go out there and break stuff. But you break stuff so cool, Gap. I just hope I can put on a match like that someday and, and have that sort of confidence on the mic. A reason why you can't. You may be new around here, Psycho Cell, but you could be the future of TBD someday. <laughs> Heck, she could be the future of WWE tomorrow. Literally. Really, Sally? You're going to the WWE Vegas tryouts? You're not mad, are you? I do feel bad even thinking about leaving after everything you've done for me. After everything you've done for this whole locker room, really. There's a reason why we call you the captain around here. Who am I to stop you from pursuing an opportunity like that? I'm not mad. I'm excited for you. Huh. Even sounds like she means it. What's that mean? Let's just say that WWE is not exactly looking for people like me. They have a type. I'm good at doing my own thing. Different strokes, you know? They were literally looking for people exactly like you. Cap turned them down a few years back with some strong four-letter words.